We return once again to France to to where are we? Aquitaine. To Aquitaine, to France, to the Middle Ages. And we have a lot of goals in front of us. We are to become king of Aquitaine, we are to become independent from France, and we are to conquer probably more down here, I think. Also, I am going to check here because I just conquered some, uh, destroyed some pagans here, so let's see if the Pope likes us more. He does not. This is our friend, Lucia the first of Toulouse. We put her in her place. Well, we made her Duchess of Toulouse, so she likes us a lot. And hopefully, once we become king of Aquitaine, she'll join us peacefully and we'll become even more powerful. That's the goal. Let's start working towards that goal, shall we? There we are. Oh. Oh, nice. More money. More money for me. We are currently ambitioning towards becoming Marshal of France because it seemed like a good idea at the time. Not sure how how's my military doing. I need some more time to recuperate. The tournament ends and although I have not won any of the melee events, my prowess did not go unnoticed. Yeah, that's right. There were a grand tournament held by King uh, King Robert the uh, really 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 old 83 now years old he has apparently married a 17 year old girl that's kind of creepy but okay i might uh, do that if i live till i'm 83 as well it could be nice maybe she could help me she could uh, change diapers or something uh, so, okay, I gained 50 prestige, that's nice. I didn't win, but I did well. And that's an unfortunate number. Let's hope the Pope doesn't spot it. Can press on weak claims, and I need a guardian for my eldest son, Joan, named after me. We will check here. He is quick. He got all his mother's smarts. Let's educate him to be a clever person, I think. Not a theologian. We'll go for a grey eminence. Diplomatic route. Would be nice. Could be nice. If my brother and the bishop of something died a cripple. My brother could be my future chancellor, maybe. And I got another son. Son Asnar of House Watu. Swell. And he's also my new heir. I uh, didn't check. Did you get? You did not get any of your mother's smarts. The Countess of Armagnac has inherited the County of Armagnac from the Count of Armagnac. No Armagnac is somewhere there. You are four years old. You're in for a rough time. He died of the Great Pox. So he was in for an even rougher time than you are. I'd say. And my Wisdom and Mercy are legendary indeed. And it seems my steward wants to steal my duchy. I do not approve. Don't want to throw him in jail, because that would be bad. I need a new steward. Just stop. I am so much more powerful than you that you should really stop that. Yes, you keep telling me that there's never been a shortage of troops ever. So let's see here. This is me. I can raise what? 8... 8.9 troops? 8900? 
My leash. It's one of these buttons, I think it's this one. My leash can raise 25. However, we'll have to deduct my like 9000, right? So he still have more than me. How about if I, because I'll probably start a faction or something and then I'll get friends to help. So what if she's in my faction? She can raise 3000. I can get 9. That's 12 out of that. That makes it kind of a bit fairer. If I could then drag someone else too, perhaps someone up north, which would probably be these dudes. Where is he? I don't know. Oh, hang on. Is it you? Prince Robert of England, who is apparently part of... I don't know. He has no leash. That's because England has exploded again, as it's as it tends to do. It's this dude, right? The Duke of Champagne. I think. Chartre Troisen. Not Reims, apparently. Why not Reims? Ah. Okay, so this dude. If I could get this little kid to join too. This it's Philippe, right? Yeah, Philippe of Champagne. That's another two and a half thousand. That should give me a good dose. Maybe I could get Burgundy. Well, I think that's the smartest thing. Start a faction. Unless I can plot. Can I plot to become independent? I don't think I can. I can plot to king the kill the king, but that's silly. I'm gonna die real soon anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna have to start a faction and hope I get support. And the Count of Lamarche changed hands, and my wife died a natural death. Well, that means she will not give me any more children. That's for sure. And my domain is too big because I lost her stewardship support. That's bad. This means I will have to sit down and I will have to find a new queen. Someone, or duchess rather, someone who's not married. Uh, preferably a woman. Doesn't really work otherwise. Probably be my religion, because it's a damn nuisance getting my otherwise. Good if they'll be an adult already. Don't have to wait. And that generally means there's rather slim pickings. She's apparently very attractive. She's also 69 years old. Let's sort by age so we can skip the ancient ladies. Uh, something a bit more reasonable done in this range, probably. And I should probably skip this, but I don't think, you know, you know what, I don't really need someone awesome this time. I don't think. I might just marry for stats, honestly. Be a good idea. Make a quick scan down the line. And I'm gonna miss the perfect bride because I'm a bit rushed and I don't want to spend an eternity looking for a new wife. And this must be absolutely hilarious for you to watch. Very nice, very nice. Okay, who has the best, best, the best stewardship and the best age combination? This is really good. Oh, 
quick as well. Cornelia Doria. An Italian lady from Venice. Sellers, envious, just, temperate, craven. She's quick. This is... Pardon me, miss. What would you say to a marriage? With me. You would say yes. You are only a courtier, so I lose a crap load of prestige. I have prestige to spare, and I'm getting a lot more every day. Hmm. House Doria. Are you of House Doria? No, Morosini. I will marry this lady. It's a done deal. There we go. Didn't take too long. That's nice. And she's Midas touched. And we can get a bunch of money or half our prestige back. Let's go for a bunch of money. If I'm gonna fight the king later, I might need mercs. Yeah. That's nice. She has arrived at my court. She's right there. My wife, the Duchess of Aquitaine. Splendid. And the Count of Bern. The Count of Bern does not have an heir or a wife. Well, he has an heir. But. It's the Count of Carcassonne. Isn't that a board game? Which I have no clue where it is, but it's probably not in a good place because it says it'll pass outside my realm. So you should get married, dude. You marry someone, anyone. Here, this one. No. Damn it. I'm your leash, do what I tell you. Okay, find someone, please. Have a child. Castle walls in Bordeaux. Now I could expand my military here. With light cavalry, or barracks perhaps, heavy infantry, could get more tax income. Light infantry and archers. Better morale and enforcement with the retinue size for the training grounds. Or I'll save the money. Now it would be really nice if I could become the Marshal of France. Because you know what? I am going to I am going to throw my hat in the ring and I'm gonna start a faction. A faction for independence. Members seek complete independence when sufficiently powerful. I'm gonna press an ultimatum to King Robert. The leader of the faction is likely to take greater risks than other faction leaders and will have fewer bombs of a strike among the nations already under attack. This is my goal. Independence. My strength is half that of my leash. I can demand it straight away. Is it possible to like invite people to my little thing, to my party? I think they'll just join on their own behalf. Well, I have started an independence faction. Anyone want to join? We're pretty strong. We made more city walls. And we became better at cavalry. Oh, I can invest in tech. Very nice, military tech. You know, yeah, well, yeah, military tech as well. Should we spend that on cavalry, maybe? This will decrease the siege length. That could be useful. 
be very useful actually. Especially if I'm gonna go to war with France soon. There'll be a lot to siege. Though if they defeat me in the field I won't have a chance to siege so I might want to improve my cavalry. So probably... This won't do anything for me as a duke but it will help when I'm king. Don't need these, I don't think, at the moment. We'll go for legalism. We'll improve legalism. And here I'll probably just go for castle infrastructure. Better castle tax. And more advanced barracks. Yeah, we'll go for castle infrastructure. And now back to this question. The question between catapults and the horses. Horse catapults, maybe. To fire horses with a catapult. Hmm. The siege speed is four. Yeah, we'll do it. Improved siege tech. Okay. Now I'm just hoping people will join me. Join me. Join me. Hey, you want a gift? That was too much. Sorry, changed my mind. I still can't get her uh, recommunicated, and I lost my spy master. Great. New spy master, please. But this dude, he doesn't hate me. He's the best option. He wants to become a spy master, so he'll like me even more. Nice. Okay, scheme. Study. Do some scheming. I don't want anyone to kill me accidentally on purpose. And a new baron in somewhere. Oh, and I am. Instituting a tax, higher tax on cities. Okay. Didn't know I were trying to do that, but then I'm getting more money, so let's build barracks. Yes. Oh, and now there is something happening here. Excommunication war. Who's the strongest? I think it looks like... Let's see who's the strongest... Can't do anything. Can give her money. She's not the strongest by a big margin though. Furnish Norman... Uh, would the jewel war over Vexen. Now she's well they he were like independent, right? Yeah. So fine. Garcia died. In the dungeons. Because no one wants him. I am making a lot of money. I'm making bank on this. Not bad. Not bad at all. I think I think our Toulouse friends might be winning, perhaps. Duchess Hildegard has founded Prince Simon for France. King Henri. Oh, I think Robert just died. King Robert died. A natural death at age 85. And his. Son, maybe? His son, who's 61, took over. And immediately someone started a faction to get someone else on the throne. <laughs> Go French politics! And now they want seniority succession. And he also joined a faction. Did he start a faction and join another faction, or did I misread that? No, no, I, I believe he did. Yeah. 
Okay. He is just pressing every way he can. Yeah, Toulouse is whipping Auvergne's ass. Oh, great. It's been a success, Pop Sergius. Uh, thinks I'm a good guy. Now, since he thinks I'm a good guy, could you do me a favor and get my friend back in the church, please? Thank you. And that should have ended the war, because the Casus Belli doesn't exist anymore. And King Henry of France has declared a war for Duke Odon, the first claim on Fouvès. Who is Fores and where is Fores? There. He's pressing a claim. I think the war his father started with Norman they just disappeared. When he died. Which is fine. This is not the time to press my thing. Well, things are happening. My thing here because... Um... Wouldn't be good. For us it's a one province little thing here. It will be crushed real soon. And apparently I'm out fighting again. My experience in matters of war has increased again. And there are many things I will do differently in the future again. So we got this again. Speed and retreat or experimenting. Now we picked the defense one before. I think I want to experiment a bit because I'm not sure what this is. But being unpredictable is probably not entirely bad. So yeah, let's do that. We got two leader traits now. My experimentality is 46.5. Really high. And for us accepted and it was released and he was imprisoned. Not necessarily in that order though. He's powering up all them. And the dude loves me even more. Okay, let's see, can I can I be naughty? Can I? No. The Pope likes the king too much. I can't have the king excommunicated. That would have been really nasty though. And Duchess Hildegard has joined another faction. Count of Limousine inherited the County of Limousine from the Count of Limousine. And this one is growing. And my wife, my new wife, Cornelia, oh, is pregnant. I'll have more children. It'll be interesting to see what happens once I die. Honestly. Could be really bad. Please be with me. I have discovered a plot where someone seeks to do something to me. Stop doing anything to me. That's mainly just annoying. Honestly, when you're when you're so powerful, so strong and awesome as me, um, yeah, I was thinking something. Then I interrupted myself. Mm. That's right. I was looking here. Apparently, my strength is currently seventy-three percent of my leash's strength. Not sure why. Seems it should be smaller. He can only raise 19,000 troops. And if I press now... And he doesn't give in... He'll lose 9,000. Because that's my dudes. Or something. He'll lose a bunch of people anyway. And then maybe these dudes will... Start making trouble too. 
because they'll have a much higher strength ratio. But I really want someone else to join me. What a friend. Yes, I forgive. Forgive, never forget. Oh, great. Toulouse joined the wrong faction. She should have joined mine. Why are you joining that one? Come be independent with me. And they're gonna declare soon. If they declare, I will request independence, because I don't want any part of that. So go. Come on. A daughter. Oh, the uh, Hermengildo got a daughter. Congratulations, peasant leader. You have a peasant child with your noble wife. Count of Armandoi has been imprisoned. Sucks for him. And Count Armandoi has left the prince for France group. That's bad. Now they have less than 50% strength. They'll probably not press. Okay, we have a squabbling bishop. He has 13. He has 12. He's celibate. He's also infirm and stressed. I'll let you take a break. You'll be my new court chaplain. And they released him. Maybe he'll rejoin the throngs of nastiness. It would be hilarious, actually. They arrested him. He quit the faction. They released him. He rejoins the faction. That would be awesome. What's this? Genoa? Are you fighting Genoa? Why are you fighting? No, you're not. Who is this? Who are you fighting? I don't know. Alias is no longer the guardian of someone. I'm gonna check. I haven't checked this. I actually have a retinue cap of 1882. I can get myself a retinue. I can get myself a heavy cavalry a retinue. Knights. My own personal knights. I shall get me my own personal knights. That will hopefully crush some fools. But not right now, they will be crushed in the future when I declare independence from my unrightful leech who I don't like because I want to be king myself. So we forge on into the future of everything.